Hi guys, now I'm going to show you how you can use a else statement in Java. So I'm going to make a very simple program to show you the use of FLs. So if you're a beginner, you can easily learn the basic steps as how to use FLs statement. Right, okay, so let's just start the program. First, uh, before using it, we must have some variables, right? So we are going to declare variable. N, and we are going to initialize it right 7 okay now you have to write if statement right let's take n if n is less than 7 right this is how you are going to use it and put braces system dot out dot print line okay now simply type the statement that the number is less than 7 right okay we have to close the bases as well under else what you're going to write system dot out dot print line right the number is not less than 7 Okay, so you just saw how easily can you use if else, right? So here, if number is less than seven, is going to print is going to print the same that the number is less than seven. This condition, right? Now under else, whatever, if it is not seven, if it is uh, up, then it's going to uh, print that the number is not less than seven. Okay, let me show you through another one by accepting a number from the user right so if you have seen my previous videos uh, I already told you how to uh, take the input from the user right we need a scanner class to take the input from the user so instead of n okay now we'll take the input n from the user user side right now let's we're going to write another line just simply write enter the number so uh, by writing enter the number when we will uh, when we will execute this program this line is going to be printed first then we will accept the input from the user side now for accepting uh, input as an integer we have to write like n equal to object name dot next int right okay as simple as it is so here I already told you in my previous videos that is can as the class name and is the object and is the keyword right and system dot in is the input stream so after writing this enter the number now is it will take the input from the user right here okay okay so, so let's test it so if n is less than 7 right uh, it's going to print that the number is less than 7 if it is more like 8 if you print if you type in 8 9 or anything else it's going to say that the number is not less than 7 Okay, let's run the program. Uh, it's very easy to run the program in Eclipse here. You simply have to click on run. Click on OK. Okay, it's launching this. Okay, so now it's giving here. Enter the number. Right? Suppose I write over 8. So it's giving the number is not less than seven, right? So it's okay. Let um, okay. Now you can see here how the flow is going. You check the statement right here, right? If n is less than seven, so it is not less than seven. So from here, if it leaves this this whole portion leaves and goes to the else and types the same thing. Okay, let's run it one more time.
taking a bit of time, I don't know why. Okay, it's here. So type in under like four. Okay, and hit enter. So it's coming that number is less than seven. So you check the condition here that n, which is uh, I entered four, four is less than seven, right? So it printed the number is less than seven. So basically, this is how you are going to use FLS statement in Java. Thank you for watching.